On either side of the Gate of Light of Heptapolis extend the seven petala, or horseshoes, surrounding the entire city. At three of the petala, the Acropolis and the two ancient theatres will be built, while in the other four petala, the building complexes of Green Planet Earth will be built. Here assembled are the largest research and experimental scientific forces in the world, who, with uniform strategies and methods to tackle the world's problems, will work to save the ecosystem. In each of the four areas of program Green Planet Earth, there will be created research and experimental ecosystem centers, in Zone E, with strict scientific standards, will be investigated and backed by rigorous experimental data, the limiting of consumption, hybrid systems applications, the applications of recycling dispensables and sewage, viability and development sustainability, the sustainable development of mass communications, control of global climate change, ensuring the functioning of the biosphere and biodiversity and dietary changes, Zone K will operate three centers developing green technologies and clean energy. These centers are in constant electronic communication and collaboration with similar centers in technologically advanced countries and will monitor, supervise and ensure a global scale in the following areas of research and testing. Geothermal research, solar thermal surveys, aeolian research, in Zone L, the Center for the Global Control of Flora and Fauna will be constructed. In that center, scientists will examine the totality of information relating to the risk of extinction of species of the animal and plant worlds. Here, the methodology will be grounded in strict scientific criteria and will provide the required solutions to problems concerning control of animals and plants under threat of extinction on land, sea and air. In Zone M, the center of control of water resources will operate. We live in a world where the seas and oceans are contaminated. The waters of rivers are contaminated and decreasing continuously. The lakes are transformed into marshes and underground water reservoirs tend to disappear and all because of the lack of a single global rescue package of water resources of the Earth we inhabit. This will work. Rescue control centers for the contamination of water in the oceans, the seas and coastal wetlands. Rescue control centers from contamination of lakes and groundwater and reservoirs affected by nuclear waste. Centers for development and rehabilitation of streams of the earth and converting them into reservoirs, ponds and centers of irrigation of croplands. The International Heptapolis as Green City will be the global model of green technology for the protection of nature and the ecosystem. The mountainous volume of Mount Parnassus, which dominates the entire western side of the city, will be transformed into a large ecological park of dense vegetation with beautiful lakes and families of animals.